Hey guys, Thunder E here and welcome to my gamer review of the Galaxy S20 Plus. Now, a lot of people are leaning towards this device and I figured it's time to do a gaming video to see how well it functions in those kind of environments and see what we get. Now, to help us with this video is our partner, Visible Mobile, who are sponsoring this video, where you can get $40 unlimited text, talk, data, a mobile hotspot with no contract. And they're helping me with this giveaway. So watch all the way through, stay to the end, and let's go check out some games. The Galaxy S20 Plus is a lovely device. Now, in terms of just quick comparisons to the S20 Ultra, it is just lighter. It's a really light device. And you've got more colors too as well. So you can see uh, it, it kind of looks white though. But this is like the light baby blue color. And I like that it's got those kind of options. Now, this device packs in a lot of features. You do have a very solid camera array, which you can check out our camera video versus the S20 Ultra and the iPhone. This stacks up and holds up on its own. So if you're thinking of, okay, cameras and stuff, this will do well. So how about gaming, right? We do have the Snapdragon 865 processor. We've got 12 gigs of RAM in this device as well. Uh, it does have a 4,500 milliamp battery and it does have a uh, fast charging up to 25 watts. I did try the 45 watt charger. I didn't see any difference. So I'll say it's at 25 watts. I will check that again, but that's what I've gotten so far. Now, when you have all that, what do you get with you know, gaming performance with a device like this, with, you know, your standard mobile games, you get 120 frames per second because this device has to display at 6.7 inches, supports 120 hertz uh, at 1080p and of course not at a 2K resolutions, which is standard across the S20 uh, series line. So let's take a look at the games we have, the kind of performance, and then we'll go from there. Back in the fight. Successfully. You 
So, in terms of gaming, this thing handles really well. I mean, it's smooth, there were really no hiccups or anything. And uh, when you looked at just all the games that you saw on the, you know, playing uh, off an Android device, it's really solid. Now, in terms of temperatures, we've got about 95 degrees, which is a little higher than I would like. I think with the vapor cooling chamber, hopefully that should come down. Although I'm not sure if this device has a vapor cooling cha chamber and that's not left for the Ultra. If I'm, I'm wrong with that, let me know. But that's what I got with temperatures, right? Uh, audio is really good. Uh, speakers are loud and clear. You hear that with the games. And the speaker levels are around the same for me with the S20 Ultra. So that's why I didn't do a specific speaker test with this this device. Uh, now, you guys probably saw that controller. You were like, okay, what's that controller you use to play Call of Duty? That is the GameStar F4 controller. I wanted to just kind of showcase and use it here. I'll be doing a full review on my gaming channel, so go over there to Board Gamer to check it out. But it's a simple controller, trigger buttons, it kind of folds in. I like just that whole, uh, you know, mechanism of folding it and it fits with your S20 Plus and your S20 Ultra. So take a look out for that. Now, something I didn't spend a lot of time and was actually gaming using the Galaxy Buds. And I did that here with the Galaxy uh, S20 Plus, and it has a specific gaming mode. And I have to say though, what it really does, besides amping up the bass, is giving you really proper directional sound. So while you're playing uh, PUBG or Call of Duty, you can hear exactly where those gunshots are and the positioning is really good. I know it's not just, you know, from my right or my left. I know it's like, you know, uh, right by my, you know, five o'clock around here. Uh, positioning is nice. It, it does a really good job and I think a lot of people should definitely try it out if you picked up the Galaxy Buds Plus. I think overall, you will like to use this device to, to game. Whether you're uh, just using your hands to glide across the display, 240 hertz start sampling, is really good. That is solely understated. It makes playing FPSs on uh, your smartphone like the Galaxy S20 Plus really, really solid. I mean, I think that kind of performance is great. Um, in terms of battery life, I would say the battery life, of course, is a little less than the S20 Ultra because it's got a slightly smaller battery uh, and it does show. Uh, I played from about three to about 6 p.m. and uh, I lost about 50%. So it's a little higher than I would like, but I do like the fact that when using it regularly, this device really handled well in terms of battery life. Now. Uh, the other thing to take note, of course, is that you have a device that can also use uh, streaming services like, uh, you know, uh, GeForce Now, as well as also Project X Cloud. And with those services, they run really well. Uh, being able to, of course, the app runs 120 frames per second. Don't know why, but uh, the games run well. I just wanted to just quickly show that for people who would ask about streaming services, if they work well on this device. I think overall, I do like what it brings to the table and that's something I think a lot of people are looking for. Okay guys, we reached the part of the video you've been waiting for. As I mentioned earlier, we're doing a giveaway with our friends at Visible Mobile and we're giving away a Galaxy S20 and two months free of Visible Mobile. Um, and it's super cool and that's great. All you have to do is go ahead and leave a comment down below of what you like about the Galaxy S20 series and leave your Twitter handle so I can select you as a winner. I will announce the winners in five days, so stay tuned. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much it, guys. If you have any questions or any comments about this video, or you wanna check out Visible Mobile where they have some really cool uh, alternative plans where you can pair up with your friends and families and reduce the cost of your plan lower than that $40, use the link down below. Otherwise, guys, thank you very much, and always enjoy your entertainment.